Colossians chapter 3 verse 16 say let the word of Christ do well in you richly as you teach and admonish one another with all wisdom and as you sing psalms and hymns and spiritual song with gratitude in your hearts to God if you fill your mind with the right thoughts according to what God say in his word and by his spirit there won't be any room for the wrong thoughts when you go around constantly thinking i am strong i'm healthy i'm blessed I have the favor of God. God loves me and has a wonderful plan for my life. Then, when the negative thoughts try to come in or knock on the door of your heart, there will be a sign, no vacancy. They won't be able to get in. Please keep feeding your spirit and your mind with the word and yielding to the Holy Spirit. Let God fill your thoughts with His truth, and you will be victorious and strong and powerful. Let us take inventory of our thoughts so that we will not keep the negative thoughts in our heart. You need to take inventory of what is occupying the rooms of your life. If you give fear a room, faith gets left outside. There is not room for both. If you give I cannot a room, I can is left outside. If you give lack a room, barely get by a room, I will never make it a room. Then increase promotion and abundance are left outside. Quit renting out space in your mind to your problems and self pity. Tell those negative thoughts, "You have occupied my room long enough. I've got a new resident coming in. My new resident is faith, joy, peace, healing, and victory. Let what God say about you have a permanent home in your heart." Let us pray, Father. Thank you that we can let. The message of Jesus Christ, the well richly in all the rooms of our life. Thank you for all the wisdom, the psalms and songs of the Spirit, the promises of God fill our mind, Lord. We declare that every fear and doubt, there is no room for you in my heart. There is no vacancy for the fear, the doubt, and the negative thoughts. In Jesus' name, Amen.